all right guys this is bank nifty and 15 minute chart now in 15 minute chart according to the moving averages price is running in a downtrend and uh, somewhere we, we have seen there was a resistance line and exactly this resistance line near, uh, near 31,150 uh, 31,150 there is a resistance and the, right now according to the price action method price is creating new higher high and higher low higher high and higher low so uh, in our previous market behavior we have seen they are creating lower low lower high and the lower low now uh, they fail to create new lower low and right now they are creating higher high and a higher low this is a symbol of trend reversal so before we enter uh, we have to analyze in a large time frame so first let me show you in weekly chart in weekly chart we have seen price was respecting moving average 20 have you seen price was bouncing from 20 bouncing from 20 similarly price is just the near bouncing moving averages uh, it is a high, it is a probability to reverse back again from this area because we everybody knows uh, first february there are uh, budget are there so uh, we never know in which direction price will go all right so let me show you in daily chart in daily chart we have seen there is a tweezer pattern have you seen it they are forming a tweezer pattern this is a symbol of bullish all right so if price continue toward upside where is our target where is the resistance line so in that case let me draw a uh, trend channel so and i connect more touches point have you seen i just connected these two swing high point and in a lower side you can see i just connected this lower point have you seen it so i just connected this lower point now exactly you can see when we connect this line they are running like that they are running like that and they are forming above this supporting line so when they are forming so it is a probability to continue toward, uh, you can say this is a trend line, right? Uh, sorry, raise trend line. So it is a probability to pull up toward this trend line. So but question is that, can I enter suddenly here for the buy? Answer is no, we can't. We need a confirmation, all right? So in that case, we have seen there is a raise trend line. So we are looking for a breakout. Once they break this raise trend line, so we'll enter for the buy and target will be somewhere here. That, that is our trading strategy. For the sell, we need a confirmation. Uh, that confirmation will give uh, in small time frame, like 15 minutes. All right. So let me show you in small time frame. In H1, you can see they are running same here already. We have seen there is 200 exponential moving average in H, uh, H4. And right now we can see a long bullish momentum candle and we are looking for a breakout this raised trend line around 31,150. So let me show you in H1. So H1 and uh, price is running in an uptrend, uh, sorry, downtrend, but uh, they're uh, just below this raised trend line here. We have seen this is the raised trend line and we are looking for a breakout. Once they break, uh, first target will be somewhere near 200 exponential. And after that, if price break this 200, so we'll continue to this level. So let me show you in 15 minutes how it should look like that. And now you can see uh, this is a 15 minute time pan and they're running in a downtrend. If you want to enter uh, for the sell in 15 minutes, you can see uh, we must find out a supporting line. Have you seen? This is called supporting line. So I just connected most recent swing low point. Have you seen it? Have you seen it? So we are looking for sell if price break this supporting line that is our sell opportunity and above this area we are looking for buy that is our buy opportunity so now you can see this is called no traded zone all right so i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video please like and subscribe thanks for watching